Hello, hello. 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 Good evening. Good evening. Hi. 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 Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to classes. How's it going? How are you? Everything fine? fine? Yes. Great. Fine. Nice. What day is today? Uh -huh. What day is today? Monday. 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 May. Mm -hmm. May the 16th. Right. 16th. Today is Monday, May 16th of 2022. That's right. Okay. Two students today. <laughs> Two participants. Okay. Good evening. We are waiting for everybody to join. Today we have our video conference number. Uh -huh. Three. Number three. On a week. <laughs> ah, yeah. This is the third week. Exactly. That's right. Correct. Uh huh. We missed one class, remember, because of Mother Day last week. So this is our conference number 10, don't worry. If you didn't remember, it's okay. All right, welcome to all the ones that already joined. Let me show you the presentation. Yes, we're getting ready. We are going to start. Okay, this is the conference to sum up with the present simple or simple present and daily routines, right? This is the unit that we're being studying for the last week. And this is our last class regarding this topic. Of course, we're gonna continue using it. We're gonna continue practicing because the idea is to get very confident, very confident with this topic, okay? Let's get started. So the topic is present simple, daily routines. Remember that we started talking about last Friday to describe what we usually do. I mean, in and out of the job or in the house or in the workplace, okay? So today is Monday, May 16th, and this is beginners one and the video conference number 10. The class objective. We are going to identify and use simple present statements with routines. Okay, so this is the objective for today's class. Let's see. Before continuing with the presentation, let's have the attendance. Let's have a look at the attendance. All right. Okay. The attendance is a bit challenging <laughs> because I have like four accounts. And then I have to switch into the right one. So give me one minute. Just one minute. Okay, here we have the list. All right, here we go. And yes, this, like somebody already said, this is the third week. Yes. Today is the 16th. The 16th of May. Yes. Here we go. We start with Miss Norma. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, Miss Norma. Hi. Hi. Okay. Good evening. Hi. Yeah, I, um, How was your weekend? I have little you have some little problems mm -hmm. with the internet and the connection. Mm -hmm. Okay, try to fix it. Don't mm -hmm. worry. 
Okay, don't worry. Okay. We understand. It's fine. Okay. Is it raining in your city? No, 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 no. It's not raining. No raining. Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. That's great. No problem. All right, Celia. Present. Hello. How do Hello. you feel? Bye. Bye. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. I like your feeling. <laughs> okay. Claudia. Claudia Maria. Nayet. Concepción Marina. Hello. Present. Hey, how are you? I'm fine. Great. Damaris, Damaris wrote on the chat. Yes, no, it was Lisset Amari, not Amari. Okay. <laughs> okay, great. So, Damari is not here yet. Kelsey Milagro? Present. Hi. Hi. How are you feeling? <laughs> okay. That's okay. Fine. I'm fine. That's nice. Mr. Ever Mena. I saw his name somewhere, Ever Alexander Men Argueta. Present. Can you Hi, hear me? how are you? Yes. Okay. Fine. Iris Liliana. Present. Hello. Hi. How is it going? It's going well? Good. All right, Joanna Michelle. Present. Hello. Hello. How's life treating you? Everything okay? Yes. All right, nice. Okay, Joanna Stephanie, not here anymore. Juan Ramon. Mr. Juan Ramon. Hello. Not yet. Judith and Ami. Not yet. Carla Sofia. Present. How are you? Fine. <laughs> Just fine. <laughs> okay, <laughs> great. Lizeth and Marilis wrote on the chat. All right, welcome. Marcela. Hello, present. Hello, thank you. Mariana Rocio. Hello, present. Hello, how are you? Good. Okay, good. Marina Yancy. Present. Hi. Hi. Mirna Lisset. Present. Hello. Hello. Monica. Present. Hi, Monica. Tania. Not here. Present. Oh my God. Present. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let me change it. And Raquel Luna. Present. Hi. Hi. All right, done. Somebody just incorporated? Let me know, please. No? No, great. We have full house, almost full house tonight. That's great. How is it going in the platform? Complete unit two? Complete. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Good. Great. Okay. Well, nice. That's that's awesome. Okay. All right. Let's continue with the class. And here we have the presentation. Okay. All right. We have just read. The objective for today's class is yeah. kind of summarizing okay. the simple present or the present simple, which is the same thing, right? Okay, statements with routines, activities that we do every day that we usually do, that it's part of our routine, right? And to start, 
Yes, daily routines. People do this activity, so more, this practice, okay? Probably you do these activities at work, like check proposals, analyze statistics, check inventories, transfer call, plan a training, organize receipts, right? So this is just to practice some of the activities that we probably do at work, okay? So let's see. Uh-huh, we have some pictures. We have the vocabulary here. Check proposals, business proposals, or plannings, right? Or projects proposals, right? Analyze statistics when we have this graph, okay? After making a, a research or a survey that we have these results, we analyze, right? We analyze the results. Okay, check inventory, what we have on the warehouse or on, on stock, right? So if it's products, so we check inventory. Transfer calls, when you are called by someone, but the person doesn't really need to talk to you, and it's a doc, I mean, he or she needs to talk to somebody else, okay? Then plan a training, okay? That's, workshops or conferences or any other uh, meeting or event that is planned in order to um to study to learn something new for the personal for the staff or for some other people could be and organize receipts when you get you know this printed uh vouchers or that you get payments so you organize those receipts right so let's see that's okay number one uh -huh. what is what is the idea in the picture number one let's see mm -hmm. from this vocabulary what is the correct name of the vocabulary for picture number one uh-huh Check proposals. Check proposals. Okay, check proposals, right? That is the correct one, of course. For the number two. Analyze. Analyze statistics. Okay, analyze statistics. That's the correct one, definitely. Uh-huh. For number three. Check in training. A training. Plan a training. Plan a training, okay? So you start making the documents, the folders, the addendums, organizing the agendas of the activities for the training, right? So that is the number three, that's right. Number four? Answer calls. Answer calls. Analyze. Uh -huh. What is it? Take it inventory. Take inventory. Inventory. Mm -hmm. But the number four is this one. Organize our Organize receipt. Organize receipt. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. So maybe these are part of the activities that probably we do at the work. Okay. Number five. Take okay. inventory. Okay. Transfer calls. This check inventory. Check inventory. No. Check inventory. Check inventory. That's right. Check, check the inventory. products and the things you have in stock, right? And the last Trump one. Card. That Trump would be transfer cost. Exactly. That would be. Do you do any of these activities at work? Anybody? Mm hmm. Transfer calls. You transfer, transfer calls. calls. Okay. Transfer so calls. I transfer calls. Organize receipts. I organize receipts. Uh huh. Mm. I check proposals, probably. <laughs> yes. I plan trainings. Yes. Uh huh. Yes. That's right. Check inventories, right? That's great. Depending on the areas, right? In which we work, obviously. Mm hmm. Here we have some others. Audit reports, take part in a conference, make phone calls, compile files, arrange an agenda, type emails. Some of these we already have them, right? 
So once again, all the reports take part in a conference, make phone calls, compile files, arrange an agenda, and type emails. All right. Let's see. Let me move just this. All right. <laughs> yes, could you please help us out with the microphones? That would be nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let me see if I can move this. All right, there we go. Okay. So there you have the pictures number one, number two, number three, number five, number six. What do you think is number one? All the reports. Okay. That could be. Give me one second. I need to just make some Yes. There you go. Thank you. All right. Okay. Now, once again, let's do this again. Yes, the first one would be all the reports. Yes. Number two. Mm -hmm. Type uh, email. Oh, type an email, right? Type emails in plural. Type an email to be if you only do one, but I don't think we only do one email. We do a lot of emails, right? So type emails. All right. Number three. Take part in a conference. Take part in a conference. Exactly. When you are invited as a guest to well chair to talk to describe okay to give a talk to give a speech in a conference right number four make phone calls make phone calls right exactly number five arrange arrange an agenda arrange an agenda that would be arrange an agenda, okay? Greetings and welcome, this goes founders, blah, blah, blah. Everything that is going to happen in, a, in an event, of course. Okay. And number six. Compile files. Compile files, okay? Do you do any of these activities from this slide and from the previous slide? Okay. Compile files. Uh huh. Say emails. Uh huh. Reaching agenda. Make phone calls. You do all of them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you are very busy. I see. Uh huh. Nice. Okay. Well, these are some of the activities that you might do at work, right? As I was mentioning. Okay. So from these activities, uh, some people already mentioned the activities that they do, okay, at work. And at home, we have other responsibilities, of course, right? So out the reports, take part in a conference, make phone calls, compile files, arrange an agenda, type emails, okay? So practically a lot of work in an office, right? So I remember last Friday, we were talking to somebody. Huh. We were saying now we're going to share of what people do in their work, okay? About their daily routines, of course. So this is what we're gonna do right now, okay? That's part of the vocabulary, okay? To refresh, to refresh some of the activities. But here in the manual, they ask you, okay? to talk about your daily routine. So write six activities that you do and six activities that your partner do, okay? So in this activity, uh -huh, do you remember, do you practice the activities that your partner does? 
Yes. <laughs> okay. If you don't remember, you're going to be creative. Okay. So maybe some of you were not working with somebody, but now it's just a refresh. We're going to get in groups y le van a contar de quién escribieron la rutina. Por ejemplo, no importa que usted en el grupo en el que quede ahorita no esté con los partners con quien trabajó el Friday. Pero usted les va a contar acerca de esa persona que usted escribió la rutina. ¿Ya? An example. Let's see. Mirna gets in a group with Celia, Carla, and, and Joanna Michelle. Y ella en realidad había escrito sobre mi, sobre milagro. Entonces, ella les va a contar, Milagro gets up early, she goes to work, she types reports, I don't know, whatever she does, ¿ok? So, tratando de usar, obviously, the third person singular. If there are some activities that your partner shared that she doesn't, I mean, he or she doesn't do, you can also include negative sentences, right? So, that is the idea. Si usted no trabajó con nadie, pues va a tener que ser creativo. <laughs> and think about the activities. Pero va a decir, okay, I'm going to tell you the daily routine of my partner, Juan Escalante, for example. Or I have the daily routine from Norma. Or I have the daily routine from Raquel. So you're going to be saying sentences, all right? Clear? Clear yeah. as the water? Perfect. All right. Here we go. Entonces, yo, tendría que poner, yo tendría que poner Celia, eh, wake up. Ajá. A las cuatro. Six. Ah, six a las seis. Six a.m. Ok. A.m. Um, I get up at uh, seven p.m. Seven p.m. <laughs> ah, ok, ok. 7 a.m. And number two. I, I check my email at 9 p.m. Number three. I read documents uh, from 9 a.m. at 11 p.m. Right. ¿Y qué hace con los documentos? Perdón, no entendí. Repeat. Read documents. Leo documentos. Ah, ok, ok. Mm. Eso está, está a las 10. Ajá. Ok, gracias. I take my documents at 11 p.m. Mm -hmm. I have lunch at at noon. 
¿Quién va a ir primero? O también podemos ayudarle a los compañeros que, que no estuvieron okay. para que hagan sus tareas. No sé si alguien quiere compartir sus propias actividades para que los que no hicieron la tarea la pueden hacer Ajá, ahorita. Vayan tomando ideas. Se le cortó a la compañera, ¿verdad? Hola. Se le cortó a la compañera. Sí, se le cortó el audio. A Judith. Hola, ¿me escucha? Oh, hoy sí, no, sí, hoy estoy la escuchando. <risa> Bueno, entonces si hacemos la eh, in the first time Mirna she get up at 6 a.m. and then then when she go to the work she the first check email eh, answer the answer calls eh, customers client client and take a messenger y después no me dijo nada <laughs> and then Raquel she say always eh, she cook eh, she make a cake and I ask for her what uh, numbers of cakes she do and she she, she say seven only in the morning <laughs> and the all the time she cook and sometimes she decorate the cook the cakes sorry in the afternoon she only take a uh, customer clients. Solo eso. Okay. Eh, y ahora vamos a ver la rutina de Norma. ¿Verdad? Uh -huh. O ya la tiene. Cinco ítems tengo yo. De Norma. <laughs> pues no tienes que contar más. Uh -huh. Norma. Hola, hola. Perdón, tenía apagado mi micrófono. <risa> Vaya, este... Eh, hay... White... White... <risa> My activities is get up 6 a.m. I take a shower at 6.30 a.m. I enter at work 8.30 I breakfast pupusas and check the um, uh, how do you say pedidos <laughs> the orders I check the orders mm -hmm. and I um, they, I take a shower at uh, say 6 a.m. I cook my breakfast at 7 a.m. 
She, no, I go to work at 7.15 a.m. Um, I drive, eh, como voy en el bus, I drive a, a bus. Um, I check emails. Um, usually answer call. Attend customer. Um, check message. Um, solamente only in the week. Or oh, I take a uh, English class mm -hmm. at night. Take class in the week. Oh, eso. <laughs> Otra <the> compañía. <laughs> Eh, bueno, uh, so about my routine, my daily daily routine. Um, I get up at six six a.m. Uh, take a shower, then take my my breakfast. Then then I go to the work at uh, 10 minutes after. Um, then I check emails, message, uh, prepare the little I have to work. And then I have a lunch at uh, one hour in 12, at 12. Twelve and a half. <laughs> oh? Twelve and a half. Uh -huh, twelve and a half. Uh, then finish my work up the five. And in my house, relaxing for two hours. <laughs> After the class, <laughs> after or before? After. Before. After the class? Before. 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 Yes. before. before the class, relaxing. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes watch okay. TV, talk, talk with my family. Este, sometimes I work with my dogs <laughs> sometimes <laughs> um, about a hey, receive the class english <laughs> and then <I> sleep <laughs> i finish my daily routine <laughs> <laughs> uh, my diary, uh, diary, como es? Diary routine. Daily routine. Daily routines. Uh, I'm uh, wake up at six and a half a.m. Then, you know, <laughs> I see the plants. I speak with that. And then I take a shower. And then, then I go, I drive for my work and I take a, what is this, a breakfast. Breakfast. At my coca and margarita. And then I see what happened with the day. Sometimes we, Sometimes I go to the proveedores. Suppliers. You can say supplier. Supplier. Mm -hmm. Suppliers. Products. Uh -huh. And then in the, in the lunch, I have a lunch at 
12 and a half. Uh, and then I, at five o'clock, I go into my house or something like, or I don't know what happened with my day every day. For example, today, uh, I read in a work, check email, check email, uh, maybe, ¿Cómo se le dice tomar llamadas? Sí, eh, con call. No, no, esta es hacer llamada, ¿verdad? Take, sí. take phone calls, receive take. phone calls. Phone calls, eh, uh -huh. también quiero ver. Eh, ¿Cómo se dice? Ya se me olvidó, Dios mío. Envío eh, correos. Send emails. Ah, send. send. Emails. Zen es S -E N S, ¿verdad? Tal cual, S E N D. Zen. Ajá. Zen email. email. Uh -huh. eh, yo quiero ver. Ten I am. I take. Es uh, es na eh, es snack. I take a snack. Mm. You eat snacks. Sí, mm. ajá. Uh -huh. mm. She eats. Yes, true. Snack. <laughs> okay. She eats a snack. Ajá, y luego ella se me olvidó como decía cuando iba a entregar. Mm. Mm. Eh. You have visit, visit customer. No. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, visit customer en, eh, como digo, entregar ticket de vuelo. Ay, ya se me olvidó, Dios mío, no puede ser. Deliver flight tickets. Ajá, delivery. Ah. Delivery. Sería, she how deliver. She delivers no. flight tickets. She deliver tickets. Mm -hmm. She yes. deliver, deliver tickets. Deliver tickets. Tickets, yes. ok. Eh, Eh, quiero ver en 1 p.m. Uh, take a lunch. Ok. Have lunch. You say 1. 1 p.m. 1 p.m. 1 hour. Uh -huh. uh, luego vamos a ver qué más hago. Y ahí visit eh, hospital. Ok. Eh, hospital. Ajá, doy consultas. Quiero ver cómo se dice doy consultas. Yo se me olvidó también, Dios mío. Mm -hmm. Have appointments. Doy consultas. Have appointments. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. I, I have okay. appointments. Poimen, poimen, vea. Poimen. Poimen, ok. Eh, I super, supervise, eh, ¿cómo se dice? Superviso la cocina, Dios mío. <laughs> supervise the kitchen. Uh, supervise the kitchen. Yes. Oh. En persona, y el personal, ¿verdad? The staff, kitchen. not personal. Kitchen. Sí, yeah, kitchen staff. staff. Kitchen staff or the personal. Kitchen. kitchen personal. Either or. Se puede decir kitchen staff o the personal. Yes, kitchen personal mm -hmm. would be the same. Okay. Mm -hmm. Kitchen personal. So my daily routine is I always wake up at 40, 13 a.m. Let her get, get up at 40, 35. No, 30. 35 a.m. Usually I go to work at 5 to 30 a.m. 
and later I breakfast at eight thirty. Usually get up get up of work at noon. Later I go to a supermarket after after work. My lunch is after work. Later I clean the house for the evening for at night eight the dinner. Eso sería lo mío, no sé si estaría bien. <laughs> we are talking about daily routines. Mm, ¿Perdón? Estamos hablando de las de la rutina. Ajá, de la, de la ah. mía, la diaria. Ah, ok, ok. Nos quiere contar la suya. <laughs> eh, ok. Ah... <laughs> uh, I get up at five. I make, when I get up, I make uh, breakfast and um, apple juice. Uh -huh. <laughs> Bien saludable. <laughs> uh -huh. Bueno, tiene varias cosas, pero digamos que esa es la principal. Eh, then I Hey, did you finish the practice? Yes? Yes. yes. Everybody participated in the group? The, ten, the time was enough for everybody to participate? Cool. Perfect. All right, do you have any question about describing the routine? Any doubts? Any question? No? Everything no. clear? Okay, perfect. <laughs> All right. Mm. I listen. Yes, I listen to some of you describing yes, the routine. Up. Yes, that's great. But yes, now, how up. about your partner? Tomaron nota de sus partners? Yes. Yes, of course. Nice. Okay. One second. Okay. Vamos a ver. I know you were talking about many activities, many activities at work, at home. But let's see. We're going to at least annotate some people. Let's see. ¿Quién estuvo trabajando with Carla Sofía? Vamos a ver qué me puede decir algo. Carla. <laughs> uh -huh. ¿Quién sabe qué hace Miss Carla Sofía at work? Yes. Mm -hmm. Take the message. Takes messages. Uh -huh. What else? Um, during the day, she get that. 6 a.m. Uh -huh. And then take a shower. Mm -hmm. Brief breakfast. She has breakfast. She cooks breakfast. Uh -huh. She prepares the lunch. She prepares lunch. Uh, finish uh, her work at 5 p.m. Uh -huh. uh, when she is staying in, in 
her house, mm -hmm. relax before class, okay. and then it's and then she has English classes, <laughs> and then she's not relaxed. <laughs> okay, nice. But at work, she only takes messages. She put, she put relax. ¿Qué más haces en el trabajo? Está bien todo lo que, lo que ya me describieron que ya hace durante el día, pero at work. Relax. She only takes messages. Check email. mm -hmm. Text emails. Text emails. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the phone. The phone. Answers the phone. He designed. Okay. Uh -huh. Designs. Yes. Uh -huh. He orders it received. <laughs> okay. Orders. Received. Uh -huh. What else? I said being busy at work. <laughs> she must be very busy. Check his inventory. Checks inventory. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Yes, she does a lot of activities at work then. That's great. Okay, nice. Let's see. Second. Somebody else, let's see. Ah, I heard, yes, Miss Mirna. Mm -hmm. She describes a lot her activities. Uh huh. Let's see, what does she do at work? Remember, at work. I know she does a lot of activities during the day, but at work. Mm -hmm. She 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 check email. Checks emails. Uh -huh. Answer call. Uh huh. Customer client. Answer. Okay. Right. Messenger. Answer calls. Takes messages. Uh -huh. Call service. Okay. Calls. Customers. Okay. Uh huh. What else? Uh huh. What else? What else? That's all. <laughs> That's all she does at work. All right. Let's see. How about Miss Norma? Uh -huh. Who pays attention to what Miss Norma does? Anybody? Anybody can tell me? She wake up very early. <laughs> she wakes up very early. Yes, that's that's true. She wakes up at three. That's part of her routine. Yes, but when she gets to work. Yes. Uh huh. What does she do at work? Have meetings. Ah, uh, she has meetings. She arranges meetings. Can we say that? Arranges meetings. Okay. Arranges meetings. Arranges meetings. Uh -huh. Arranges meetings. Uh -huh. Check your checks emails. emails. Checks emails. Uh -huh. What else? Uh, she goes to bank. Uh huh. She goes to banks. Yes. Uh huh. What else? Okay. She attends calls. Uh huh. She attends calls. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Checks your. Her call, calls. Uh huh. Her calls. Like phone call. Come. Attend attend meeting. She oh, attends meeting. meetings. Attend uh -huh. attend attend their meetings. Uh huh. What else? Customers too. Okay, she attends meeting and she attends customers too. Customers too. Yes. Oh my God. 
that's difficult, isn't it? Yes. It is difficult, I know. Nice. All right, somebody else. Let's see. Another person, let's have someone else. All right, let's have Milag. Milagro does a lot of activities during the day. She <laughs> gets up at 7 o'clock. She gets up at 7 o'clock. Uh -huh. Yes. She prepares her coffee and the breakfast. She prepares her coffee and breakfast. That's great. Uh -huh. Take up shower at um, 8.30 a.m. She starts to work at 8.30. Uh -huh. yes. She puts the ma maquillaje, ¿cómo se dice? Makeup. She puts on makeup. Oh, makeup. She puts on makeup. Uh -huh. Oh, makeup. Mm -hmm. um, she drives. She drives. She drives she... to work. Yes. Like she checks emails. Okay. Check the email. Phone. Uh huh. Send email. Take phone calls. Uh -huh. She eats a snack. <laughs> she has a snack. <laughs> uh -huh. She drive. She drive. She deliver tickets. She deliver tickets. That's why she drives a lot, right? Okay. Yeah. Well, she delivers. Oh, let's. She has appointments. Uh huh. Well, Super she delivers supervisor teacher stuff. Uh -huh. She attends meetings, you said? Yes? Mm, yeah. No, she supervises Supervise. teacher, staff. Supervises kitchen staff. staff. Let's, let's put it just at the yes. kitchen staff. Uh -huh. oh, she has appointments, right? <laughs> yes. She has appointments. Uh-huh. What else? She um she finished the sometime um ten o'clock after My class. My goodness. Eating. She has long days. <laughs> long <She> have, routines. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. She have a um, little time um, relax. Yes, after short time class. Relax. She she watched TV, she watched movies. That's true. Nice. nice. Perfect. Yes. yes, she does a lot of activities. Yes. That's true. Okay, these are just some examples, of course, right? You have. She you goes have, to bed 11. She goes to bed Probably. at 11. She goes to bed at almost midnight. Yeah. Probably. Uh -huh. But you have some other notes that you have taken from other classmates and that's great okay in this case mm -hmm. if you see we have written yes i i made a typo here so never mind let me see let's erase i'm sorry carla i erase all your routine okay. <laughs> <laughs> but we're gonna write it again dictate me about carla again please check emails Yes? Yes. Uh -huh. There was a mistake. There was a type of mistake. That's why I erased it. What take else? message. Take message. Oh, take <laughs> messages. Uh -huh. What else? Send emails. Send emails. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Design. Somebody says design. She designs. Uh huh. What else? Mm. Answer the phones. Uh huh. Answer the phone. She takes orders. Orders for shapes. Uh mm -hmm. Takes orders. Mm -hmm. Checks inventory. Checks inventory. True. Thanks. All right. Okay. Let's put it right here. Yes, there was a type. Of course, 
you already have taken notes from other people activities and that's great all these activities are the of course we have the the s because it's she right all of these people are third person she takes she checks she answers she arranges she supervises right all these activities go with the s because it's affirmative and we're talking about a third person okay so let me close this window and it's nine almost nine okay so let's double check the attendance let's see who continues here miss norma yes miss celia miss claudia Miss Claudia, joined. yes, <laughs> I saw you. Damaris, Damaris Eunice didn't join. Oh my goodness, <clears throat> that's not possible. Elsie, continue. Ever, Iris, Joanna, oh, Juan Ramon, just join. Hi, how are you? Hi, fine. You get home late. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> it's all right. You did. I saw you did around too. Present. Hi. Okay, and the rest were present, right? Carla, Lisette, Marcela, Mariana, Marina, Mirna, Monica, Tania, and Raquel. Done. Nice. Okay. Any question? Mm -hmm. no, questions. no questions. All right. Yes, no questions. Vamos a hacer en el chat. Vamos a escribir do you. Pero le vamos a dirigir la pregunta a alguien. ¿Ok? ¿Cómo hacemos para dirigirle exactamente la pregunta a esa persona a quien yo le quiero preguntar algo? Van al cuadrito del chat, o sea, la, la burbuja que tienen en el chat. Y aquí ustedes abren el chat. Si usted dice, este mensaje se lo quiero enviar a todos, aquí yo voy a ver, of course, right? Pues, tienen una flechita, ¿verdad? Ya lo descubrieron. Yes. <ríe> Así ahí pasan chateando, ¿verdad? En Spanish. Ah. <ríe> No, teacher, we don't do that. Ok. Vaya. Obviamente lo van a enviar ahí para que todos lo podamos ver. Pero como que usted le quiere preguntar a alguien en específico, entonces usted, ¿quién le quiere preguntar? Por decir, yo le quiero preguntar a Mariana. Y escribo el nombre. Mariana, coma. Luego digo, do you arrange meetings? Como que usted le toca organizar eh, meetings en su trabajo y lo envío. Mariana, do you arrange meetings? Y ella me puede contestar. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Yes? ¿Sí se, sí se entiende el ejemplo? ¿A quién le quieren preguntar algo? Of course, no le pregunten a alguien que sea de su mismo trabajo que usted ya sabe qué es lo que hace esa persona. <ríe> Pregúntele a alguien más. Yes? Por ejemplo, Juan, do you design... Oh, do you uh, take phone calls? Do you take orders? No sé, algo que le quiero preguntar. Va, vamos a ver la interacción. Sí, exactly. Yes, I do, dice Mariana. Ok. Judy, do you speak Japanese? Great. Ajá. Va, pues quiero ver esa interacción. Así. ¿A quién le van a preguntar algo? Escriban su name. Coma. Y le hacen la question, do you, do you cook at work? Que por ahí hay alguien que cocina, uh -huh. makes cake. Yes, yes I do. Uh -huh. Marcela, do you serve customers? Blanca, do you teach other language? I speak other languages, but I don't. <laughs> uh -huh. Nice. Celia, do you 
Ok, do you lawyer? Ahí tendría que ser, are you a lawyer? Con do tiene que ser una acción. Do you read reports? Do you create legal documents? Yes. Uh -huh. But good, good idea. Jancy, do you make cakes? Faltó el do. <laughs> do you drive? Do you deliver documents? Mm -hmm. Do you take inventories? Do you check inventory? Uh -huh. Mirna, do you cook? Okay. I don't uh, speak Japanese. Okay, Carla, do you do your homework? Do you like dogs, Belsi? Uh huh. Jancy said, no, I don't make cakes. Mm -hmm. Great. Uh -huh. I do my homework. Yes, I do it for my family. Nice. I like dogs. Do you check emails, Mirna? Are you still preguntando? <laughs> okay. Yes, I do. Uh huh. Milagro, do you take phone calls? Mm -hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh -huh. Monica, do you like music? Somebody asking Monica. Monica is very quiet today. She's not answering. <laughs> Milagro, do you take phone calls again? Uh -huh. Yes, I do. Concepción, do you have lunch at work? That's a good question. Yes, a lot. A lot of questions. Okay. Carla, do you take a bath? Uh -huh. Yes, I do. <laughs> Carla, do you check emails in the morning? Elsie, do you receive emails? Okay. One, do you, are you a boss? Ahí tendría que ser, are you? Si vamos a preguntar por la occupation, are you? Pero si hace alguna actividad, do you, ¿verdad? Do you like to clean your house? Okay, Claudia, do you like to drive to work? Uh huh. Every day, I take my calls, right? Uh -huh. No, I don't. Sí, dígalo. <laughs> My goodness. All right, let's say, do you smoke? We got <laughs> at work, impossible. <laughs> No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Yes, I take my calls. Okay. All right. Uh huh. Claudia, do you drive at work? That's good. All right. Nice. Okay. Good practice. Mirna, do you like salsa? <laughs> <laughs> From work. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Do you listen to music at work? <laughs> Do you play music on the computer? <laughs> ah, when the supervisor no está. <laughs> okay. All right. Do you design? Do you use a computer? Do you create software? <laughs> That type of question, do you like going to the beach? <laughs> okay. At work, it's impossible. We cannot go to the beach, okay? Great. Awesome. All right. Let's move on. Let's continue practicing. 
Okay, so this, do you audit reports? Do you take part in conference? <laughs> do you speak in public? Okay, do you compile files? Do you arrange agenda? That type of questions, all right? Nice. All right, let's continue. This is an email, okay? It says, hello Juan, I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I'm working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check emails in my office. I organize conference twice a month. I sometimes train new employees. I check the raw material. I never go out of my office. It is a nice job. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. This is when you tell another person about your job, okay? So, again, this is writing an email to another person telling how it is going at work, right? Hello, Juan, I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I'm working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following i always check emails in my office i organize conferences twice a month i sometimes train new employees i check the raw material i never go out of my office it is a nice job i'm looking forward to hearing from you kind regards kevin okay so what are we going to do with this vocabulary we're going to practice. Van a leer así en voz alta para que sus compañeros escuchen cuando usted esté leyendo este email. Luego usted escucha al compañero, right? O compañera. In this case, vamos a tratar solo de leer, como de dar la entonación correcta en son. Luego podemos tratar de sustituir estas activities con las nuestras. Algunas de ellas podrían repetirse, no hay problema. Y podríamos agregar o cambiar algunas de ellas. ¿Es this clear? Primero solo leerlo tal cual está. Tratar de hacer la, la pronunciación correcta. Y luego tratar de ponerlo ya como en la realidad nuestra. ¿Es this clear? ¿Hay algo claro? Uh, ¿Hay alguna question? Uh, yes, repeat, repeat. I sometimes train new uh, employ employees. 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 Algunos empleados okay. nuevos. Ok, employees. Uh -huh. employees. Anything else? ¿Algo más? I check a raw materials. Raw materials. Esta es materia prima. Material. Yes, raw materials. Something else? No? Okay. All right, All right. Bye. Ahorita les comparto la imagen, solo que vamos a trabajar con alguien más. Vamos a hacer los grupos un poco más pequeños. Let's see. Yes. Here we go. Sí, solo vamos a practicar la lectura. Voy a empezar. Okay. Hello Juan, I hope you I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activity activities I do are the flow. Bowling, 
I always check email in my office. I, I organize a conference twice a month. I sometimes train new employer. I check the raw, raw materials and I never go out of my office. It is a nice job. I'm looking for forward for work to hear to hearing from you. Kind regals, Kevin Black. Clap, clap. <laughs> Next. <laughs> and yo. Hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check email in the office, in my office. I organize conference twice a month. I sometimes try new employees. I check the raw, raw materials and I never go out of my office. It's a nice, it, it is a nice job. I am, I am looking forward to hearing from you. In regard, Kevin Velasquez. Boy. <laughs> Hello, Juan. I, I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that, that I am working in a new company. <clears throat> Some activities I do are the following. Working in new company. Some activities I, I do are the fall. ¿Cómo se dice esta palabra? Following. Boy. Following. La voy a anotar, pero. Dice, some activities I do are the follower. No. Follower. Following. Following. I always, I always check emails always. in my always. office. Always. I always. I always. Al okay. Always. I always, always, mm -hmm. I always check emails in my office. I organize conference tweet a month. I sometimes train new employees. employees, employees. Employees, Alba, si que sabe. I check the RAM, the Juan material in, in of my office. It, it is an I job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. It's a month. And sometimes train, train employees. Employees. I check the real materials. And I never go out of my office. It is a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. His regards, Kevin Velasquez. Bueno, creo que me toca hoy a mí, ¿verdad? Sí. Compañeros, bien. Sí. Okay. Hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you your time I am working in a new company. Some activity is do our the following. 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 I was checking in May 
in my office, I organize conference. Voy a poner llamadas. Creo el de check email, creo que ya lo dice aquí. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eso le quitaría. Y vamos a ver. Una vez al mes. One, once a week. Sería una vez. Once a week, una a la semana. Once. Once a month, si fuera una vez al mes. Once a month. Uh -huh. Once, se escribe así como, como once uh -huh. en español. <risa> once a month. Um, oh. I sometimes train new employees. ¿Qué significa employees? Empleados. Ah. I train new employees. Employees. Capacito. Es como asistente administrativo. Ah, yes. uh -huh. uh, I organize ah. conference twice a month. I something. Ah, no, no, no. I take the right materials and I never got, I never go out of my office. It is a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. Keep rigors, morning cargeta. Oh no, no hay. Ah, pues sí, hello, hello Juan. Y todo lo demás, y al final, Mónica Vegeta. Sí. Ajá. Ah, ok, ok. Hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. So, activities do are the following. I always check emails in my office. I, I complete files. I arrange an agents, I type emails, and I send emails, and I audit reports, and I make phone calls, and I check the raw materials, and I never go out of my office. It's a nice job. I am looking forward to hear from you. Kind triggers, Celia Chot. Excellent. Boy. Um, hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following I, wa I watch. Check miles in my office. I organize conferencing twice a month. I sometimes train new employees. I check the new I check the raw materials, and I never go to my office. It's a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. King regards Kevin Velasquez. Hearing. No. Hearing. Ajá. Hearing. 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 Hearing.
hearing from you. El otro es employed. Employee. ¿Qué significa employ? Empleado. 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 Oh. Employ. Employees. Em ¿Cómo? Employees. 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 Ah, employee. Yes. Ah, employee. Y nosotros decíamos employee. Uh -huh. <risa> Employer es el empleador, el que da el empleo. Ah, uh -huh. Ay, no, qué son los empleados. Employer es el empleador. Empleador. Y yes. empleado es employer. Employee. Employees. 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 Es empleado. Uh -huh. Employees. Y hearing. Hearing from you. Es como. Mm, estoy esperando escuchar de ti. Oh. Hearing from you. Yes. Hearing Pero from solo el hearing from you significa eso o toda la oración final? Toda la oración porque dice, I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Es como, estoy esperando escuchar de ti. O me, me gustaría escuchar de ti. Hearing from you solo es escuchar de ti. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Gracias. No more questions. No se vaya, no se vaya. Aquí me estoy, <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> Continue practicing. Continue, ok. Continuemos entonces. Sigue okay. usted, Mariana. Yo. Ok. Ok. <laughs> ok. Dice, hello Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working okay. in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I always check email in the office. I organize conference twice, twice a month. I sometimes try new employees. I check the raw material and I never go, go out of my office. It is a nice job. I am looking forward, forward to hello 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 Some activities I do are the, the following. Always, I always check emails in my office. I organize conference twice a month. I sometimes train new employees. No, como era, ya me olvido. Employees. 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 Mm -hmm. ah, employees. Employees. Bueno, otra vez dice, I sometimes try, train new employees. 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 I check the wrong material and I never go out. Hoy my own de hearing from you. Ahora usted, Judith. Bien. Bien, entonces yo. Hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you time, perdón, yo 
than I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are, are do our the following. I always check in May in my office. I organize or pardon, organize conference. Do I at most I something try new employees I'll share the run Mauterius pardon Mauterius and I never go out of me pardon of me off no my of office my off it is nice go. I am looking for one to hearing uh, from you. Algas. Out of state. Siempre me estoy equivocando en las mismas palabras, creo. Bueno. Um, perdón, ahorita voy yo. Hello, Juan. I hope you I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you team I am working in a new company. Some activity I you are the following. I always check emails in my office. I organize conference. Um, is it a twist, verdad? Twist a month. Twice. And sometimes train new employees. I check the wrong materials and I never go out on my office. It is a nice job. I am looking forward to hearing from you. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, un regalo. Oh, pero en esa palabra, twice, no sé si es... Ahí. All right, questions? It's still? ¿Cómo les fue en la practice? <laughs> good? It went good, it went well. Some problems, no problems. Regards, regards. Yes, regards. Regards. Employees. Repeat. Employees. Employee. Employees. Yes, employees. Employees. ¿Lograron poner sus actividades reales o solo lograron leer? Solo, solo leer. leer. Solo leer, ok. Bueno, vamos a dar un espacio como para que ustedes puedan como ir sustituyendo, ¿ya? Yes? Si quieren solo anoten lo, lo, lo que van a sustituir, no tienen que anotar todo, sino que, por ejemplo, eh, si él dice ahí... I arrange meetings, ustedes dicen, no, I answer phone calls, right? So, podrían como nada más ir cambiando y usar su nombre, obviously, right? So, I'm going to give you some minutes para que lo puedan modificar y luego me lo lean ya con las actividades propias. Yes? 
Si tienen alguna question, si tienen alguna duda, pues las podemos también solventar en lo que ustedes están cambiando eso. So, start now. O si alguien que ya esté listo, solo me lo dice y no lo empieza a contar. Not ready? Not yet? <ríe> ¿Alguno les favorece? Ah, ready. ready. ¿Alguno les favorece porque ya dejaron también parecidas sus actividades? Vaya. Empecemos. ¿Quién dijo que estaba ready first? Yes. Celia. Yes. Go ahead. And then not. Hello, everybody. Hi. I hope you are excellent uh -huh. i want to tell you that i am working in my new company some activities i do are the following i always check emails in my office i take documents i make phone calls and i cope i copy files and twice a month Mm -hmm. And I I order receive once a month, and sometimes I take part in a conference. Best regards. And <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice show. I, I, I never stay. Um, ¿Cómo se dice? Quieta. <laughs> quiet. <laughs> I never quiet. Uh -huh, in never. my office. Uh -huh. And I eat in my job is very funny for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I am looking forward to hearing from you. Right, vegans. Celia Chop. Nice. Good job. Excellent. Okay. Very good. Ahí caían todos los claps y todas las reactions. <laughs> good job. Uh -huh. Miss Norma, are you ready? Okay, lo voy a intentar. I'm going to try. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, hello. I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you Today I am working a new company. Some activities I do are the flowing. Always, always check emails in my in my office. I organize recipe recipes and I go to bank. Um And sometimes train new employees. Así era, ¿verdad? Employees. 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 Um, twist a month. And sometimes, sometimes um, I go the, the shopping and my work. Um, It is a nice job. I like too much. I like I it very look, much. <laughs> yes. Nice. I am looking forward to hearing for you. From you. Okay. Nice. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Nice. Someone else? Someone who is ready? No, no, no. Uh -huh. No, 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 tengo una cuenta. Someone ready? <laughs> It was easy. Don't be afraid. My stamp is Carla Valiente. <laughs> <laughs> The bravest. <laughs> Go ahead. Eh, bueno. okay. eh, hello, Juan. I hope you are excellent. 
uh, I want to tell you that I am working in the new company. Uh, some activity, activities I do are the following. Uh, I always check message from WhatsApp. Um, I organize three receipts twice a month. Uh, I sometimes I attend customers. Mm -hmm. uh, creo que lo hubiera copiado todo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I design and I never go out of my office. It's a nice job. Great. I am looking for, forward to hearing for you. Kind, kind regards, regards. Uh, Carla Chavez. <laughs> nice. Good job. Excellent. Uh-huh. One more, one more participant. Mm -hmm. okay. Another brave, brave heart. Si no, Miss Carla, voy a elegir. My. Ah, Lizette. Amaris. Hi. 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 Um, my activities. Um, I had a, I get up. I prepare breakfast. I get ready for work. I take my children to school. I go to work when I arrive and shake and send emails. I make make calls. Then I I go 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 up to make visit to to request an ace hair day and deliver deliver report and return my home in a six at nine I come to my dinner my homework with my children and take my English class. Then I prepare the uniforms I fold and time for the next day. I take shower and take go to sleep. Oh my God, that's a long day. <laughs> that is a lot of activities, okay. Great. She was very brave to share all the activities she does during the day. Okay. Good. Good work. Good job. Claps, claps, claps. Okay. A round of applause. So, yeah. <laughs> all right. Someone else? Uh huh. The last one, vaya, el último ya. Todos tienen sueño. Are you sleepy? En cara de, ah, let's go to bed. Ok, Claudia, mis Guerrero. Solo porque el apellido la delata. Es. Ok. Hey. Hi. Hi. Uh, hello, Blanca. Hi. <laughs> I hope you are excellent. I want to tell you that I am working in a new company. Some activities I do are the following. I check emails during the day and I attend meetings once a week. I shop materials for construction and I often visit projects. It is a nice job. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Kind regards, Claudia Guerrero. Nice. Very good. Good, good, good. Thank you. 
All right. Los demás de tarea les va a quedar ¿no? sin leer. No reading. Y lo que va a pasar un clap. And everybody, no. no. Just kidding. Okay. Let's continue. It's all right. Okay. PowerPoint. One second. Okay. It's here. Okay. This is just as a reminder. Okay. Vamos a ver. Este es un cuadro. No sé si se logra ver. Este me, me indica. Está un poquito oscurito, pero es un repaso, obviamente, de la forma negativa del simple present, ¿ok? I, you, we. Obviamente, you se repite por you singular and you plural. And they. El auxiliar sería do not que ya contractado es don't, más el verbo, siempre va a ir el verbo, ¿ok? So, I do not work in Santa Ana, for example, yes? We do not or we don't study French, yes? You do not or you don't uh, live in Spain, yes? So, this is for the negative form, ¿ok? And for he, she, it, does not or doesn't, which is the contraction, and the verb. So, in negative statements, does not or doesn't, do not add S. Aquí, ya aunque sea la tercera persona, no le vamos a agregar S al verbo. Yes? So, do not add S to the base form of the verb. She doesn't exercise. Okay? She doesn't exercise. It's incorrect. Right? So let's annotate so drawings. Uh huh. Circle doesn't or don't to complete the sentences. An astronaut on the International Space Station doesn't have a lot of free time. Aquí está resuelto el primero. Astronauts doesn't or don't work all day on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Don't astronauts don't right don't don't work oh. all day on Saturday. An astronaut, this is uno. An no astronaut sense. doesn't have the same schedule every day. Okay, we doesn't or we don't work on weekends. We don't, don't work. work on weekends. We don't. Oh, okay work on weekends, right? My office doesn't or don't have a window. I don't. No, my, office. my office doesn't. Doesn't eat, no? Mm -hmm. Yes, doesn't, oh right. Doesn't y nos saltamos la number four. Uh -huh. We doesn't or we don't work on weekends. We don't. We don't, don't work on right. weekends. We don't work on weekends, that's right. She doesn't, she don't travel for her job. Doesn't. She doesn't, she doesn't, she doesn't she travel, travel yeah. for her job. Okay, this is the other one, ya no se logra ver, so don't worry. So it's okay, this is just, yes, just yeah, as a don't. review. Recuerdense que se lo estamos haciendo repaso, verdad? Ya, yeah. como summarizing toda la unidad del simple present, okay? So, okay, Vemos, yes. Obviamente, to summarize, review, review significa repaso, review of the simple present. ¿Para qué usamos el simple present? For general information or routines, activities. I check emails every morning. He writes reports about meetings. She audits inventories. They arrange meetings. Son actividades que se repiten diariamente. Por lo tanto, son parte de nuestras routines. Y para eso te sube a simple person. Okay? Acá hay un exercise que es del libro, obviously, de su manual. 
Acá tenemos affirmative statements, acá tenemos negative statements. No sé si eso lo habíamos hecho last class. Do you remember? Check, check, check. Ajá, no, no me acuerdo. Ay, no, no, no. Solo las leímos. Ok, bye. Entonces en este momento la vamos a completar. Obviamente, si tiene paréntesis, tiene el not, significa que va a ser una oración negativa, pero no es que se lo voy a poner no call, no arrange, no. Tienen que llevar un auxiliary dependiendo de el sujeto, ¿verdad? Si es he, she, it, el auxiliary tendría que ser doesn't. Si es I, you, we, they, tendría que ser don't. Obviamente, no todas las oraciones que están acá son afirmativas, no todas son negativas. Entonces, tenemos que prestar bastante atención. Veamos, lo vamos a trabajar con nuestros partners. Vamos a regresar al breakout room, solo que vamos a hacer otros grupos. Vamos a deshacer estos. Yes. Veamos. Es libre en 7, recreate, vale, estaríamos de 3. Eh, pero no entendí, vamos a hacerlo el, el, el verbo que está ahí adentro, ¿verdad? Sí, a completarlo. Sí. Order. Orders con ese yeah, final. Orders. Ajá. El segundo. Ask con ese. Amy and Teresa as for Dozen for the design department on weekends. Porque ya está ahí la palabra. Lo único que vamos a ordenar es si es si corresponde a das o dozen. O dozen. Entonces, sí. Corresponde a, a lo que es dosen, ¿verdad? Porque es no de, de, de uh -huh. Hola. Hola, hola. Bien. 
Hagamos la primera para... Solo, para solo tienes que darle una S al final. Awesome. Order. Order. Sí. Order. Order. Ajá, es afirmativa. Yo creo que sí ya la habíamos hecho, ya que me acuerdo. Y creo que con ustedes lo vi. Sí, a mí también. Me es conocida también. Mm, bien. Helen. Helen. Amy, interesa. Ahorita estamos en la dos. Uh -huh. Tienes razón. Uh -huh. Amy Teresa. Como ahí sería de ella. Amy Teresa. La regla no aplica, solo se escribiría tal y como está. Sería para la tercera igual. Helen, pero ahí sería en negativo. Así que sería. Sería en. Muchas gracias. No hubiera inventado como. Ah, sí. Mario. Siempre en las seis. Keep. Doesn't keep. Ajá, dos en keep. A record of the merchandise. Vice, la S. Hello. Ay, todos me hicieron a vos te saben. Yo vos te sé primero, pero se los pasé. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Boy, boys, boys. Solo boy, verdad? Or boys? Boys. Ah, boys. Boys. Pero, ah, pero la Y siempre queda ahí. Solo le agrego la S. Yes. Mhm. Mm yes. Study sería study. Study. Ajá, sería, le agregas study y study es, sería study. Ajá. Ajá. Se cambiaría y es, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, porque la que ah. está presidiendo es una consonante. Una. Donde dice que. Uh -huh. Creo que porque ya. Ya. Bueno, no sé. Keep, keep ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. um, I have a question. Teacher. Yes, tell me. In uh, número uno, mm -hmm. o sea, o sea, la seis, dice Mario, eh, real, doesn't keep. In negative, record, right? Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. A record of the merchandise he buys. Entonces ahí sí se le agrega la S. Only S, yes. yes. Mario doesn't keep a record of the merchandise. He buys. Yes. ¿Y en qué? ¿Por qué no lleva la S? Porque ella lleva el auxiliar de Dutton. Ah, ok, ok. Sí, sí. Okay, thank you. All right, perfect. Finished, right? Finished. Yeah. Ok. Yeah. Hi. 
Did you finish? Finish. Great. Great, great, great. Okay. Ajá, ¿cómo nos quedó este mambo number five? Okay. She makes many phone calls. She doesn't make many phone calls. Wait a minute. I have a mosquito here. Okay. He carries boxes into the truck. He doesn't carry boxes into the truck. Cindy sends reports to other companies. She doesn't, or Cindy doesn't send reports to other companies. He helps workers to be on time. He doesn't help workers to be on time. My boss talks about the new rules. My boss doesn't talk about the new rules. Creo que habíamos hecho este exercise. Sé que definitivamente será un repaso. No excuses. <ríe> no excuses whatsoever. ¿Cómo les quedó la número uno? He orders everything. In the Ajá, he orders everything in the office. Two, Amy and Teresa. As. 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 For the same to es or no es? No es. No es. Mm -hmm. Because it's Amy and Teresa. It's they, right? Two ladies. Two women. So Amy and Teresa as for the signatures, for the signatures every Friday. Helen. Doesn't does call. Doesn't call or does not. Call. Remember the contraction of does not is doesn't, right? So oh, Helen doesn't oh. call the design department on weekends. She cleans. She cleans she our cleans desk in the morning. The morning. Next, I write. I write. I write at least with the things we need at 9 a.m. And Mario doesn't keep, keep. keep a record of the merchandise. He buys. Buys. Great. Merchandise who is needed. What is the meaning of merchandise? Merchandise. 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 Mercadería. Yes. Merchandise. Great, great, great. Good job. Bueno, la última vez que pasamos la pendence, que ahora todos estuvieron, a excepción de Damaris, Eunice. ¿Verdad? Siguen uh -huh. acá, Norma, Celia, Claudia, Concepción, yes, Elsie, sí, Ever. Ever, no he escuchado a Ever casi. I know what. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Iris, Joana, Juan Ramón, no, Judith, no. Carla, Lisette, no, no. Marcela, Mariana, Marina, Mirna, Mónica, Tania. Ah, también Mónica ha estado bien callada. En Raquel. ¿Quién le toca no, no. este día? Ajá. No. Joana Michelle, creo. Joana Michelle ya le correspondió quedarse los 10 minutos. Uh -huh. El viernes me tocaba, licenciada, pero no pude ingresar a la clase. Estuvo teniendo dificultades con la plataforma. Sí. Sería ese día entonces. Yes. Ok. Okay. Bye, good night. Bye, good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. The rest enjoy. Good night. Night. Go to bed. <laughs> Bye. Hi, Joanna. Joanna or Michelle? Joanna. Joanna. <ríe> Tell me, ¿qué le había pasado? Fíjese, Lee, que el, el viernes estuve un poquito mal de salud, por eso no pude conectar. Y también me estaba dando problemas en la plataforma. Y está con su 
PC o con algún otro dispositivo. Con mi teléfono. Mm. Sí. Pero sería la, la aplicación de Zoom. Sí. Y lo logro solventar. Sí, fíjese que a veces me saca y no, no sé por qué. Y de repente ya no me deja entrar, solo dice conectando. Y ya no, ya no logro conectar. Tal vez algún update de la aplicación. Hola. Tal, tal vez algún update, alguna actualización de Zoom. Sí, sí que eso pensé yo, pero está, está actualizada. Está actualizada la app. Sí. ¿O tal vez la, la, signo, la señal? Quizá eso, fíjese, porque este, generalmente cuando como que quiere llover, vea, se me va la señal. Uh -huh. y, o cuando hace mucho viento, ¿verdad? Sí, se Yo creo que bien, por, bien más débil. que todo por eso. Uh -huh. Ok. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo ha estado? En cuanto al pues, tal, la plataforma, los ejercicios, los temas. Fíjense que en la plataforma voy al día con las actividades. Uh -huh. Este, me parece bastante interesante, me gusta hacer las actividades. Este, y en la medida de lo posible, ¿verdad? Lo vamos entendiendo. Sí, una vez. La estructura del Simple Present, ¿qué tal? Como me perdí la clase, ¿verdad? La vez pasada, <ríe> siento que ando un poquito perdida. Hay que poner eh, a refrescar otra vez el conocimiento. Sí. <ríe> ¿Y logro tener el manual? Eh, sí, sí lo tengo. Va, lo va resolviendo a la vez de la clase. Sí, sí. Ok, perfecto. Sí, eso, eso ayuda como a llevar el track, ¿verdad? De, la, de las sí. actividades. De Hay las palabritas, culturas. ¿verdad? Que a veces uno no entiende, pero ahí las voy. Sí, la puede ir buscando el significado sí. y ya, o preguntándolo. Sí. Ahí está. Sí, Muy ahí bien. voy buscando el significado. Ok. Bueno, este, este día ya hicimos como el repaso de todo la, el contenido de la unidad 2. Si a alguna hace falta algunos ejercicios, igual los podemos resolver ahorita, usted me indica. Por ahorita voy al día, licenciada. Ok, perfecto. Entonces, sí. eh, para la siguiente clase sería de estudiar ya la unidad 3, como para tener una idea, ¿verdad? De qué va a tratar, sí. que la van a resolver, pues, pero como para saber y a tener como una idea más clara de qué va a tratar, de, de qué se van a, a, a tratar los ejercicios, las conversaciones, las, la dinámica y, y esté como más, más segura y más confiada. Ok. Ok, perfecto. No sé si hay algo más en lo que le puedo ayudar. No, Lee, todo bien. Ok, nice. Ajá, entonces le vamos a pedir que nos haga tres oraciones usando Simple Present. Acerca de algo que usted hace o de algo que alguien más hace en su casa. Tres afirmativas y tres negativas. Ok. Si quieren, nos la escriben en el chat o nos la dice. Va. Ok. La voy a escribir. Ok, pues no, yo la espero. Don't worry. No okay. pressure. <ríe> no problem.
Tres afirmativos y tres negativas, ¿verdad? Exactly. Yes. Are you ready? Sí, ahorita las estoy escribiendo en el chat. All right, perfect. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. My sister does training. I do homework. We do lots of life. Are you going to write negative too? Hello? Ahorita le mandé las negativas. Okay, my niece doesn't do her homework, Mario doesn't cook, I don't watch cook. Perfect, nice. Excellent. All right, good job. So, we finished then. Okay. <laughs> See you tomorrow in class. Okay. Good night. Good night. Bye.